welcome 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 back to my channel i'm so pleased you keep on coming to this channel today we are looking at hallelujah hallelujah and that's a uh, agnos there agnos there and we are playing using four chords do re fa and so let's come back to the keyboard as I take you through the easy way to play Alleluia. Alleluia. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. Today we are looking at Agnos there. That's Alleluia. Alleluia. It's one of the most powerful worship songs that when you 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 sing wholeheartedly you always experience the presence of god in your life okay <clears throat> we are looking we are playing using four chords and we are playing in key c key c is the key, a white key around the two black keys so key c is always around the two black keys this is key c this is key c this is key c this is key c okay Let's quickly run through the scale of key C so that it will help us to deduce our chords. Okay. And we say we need four chords. The four chords that we need to play this song is this. The first one is do. And this is the root key of Do. So the moment you identify your Do, secure your octave Do for the bass. So this is uh, for the treble. So it's key C. Uh, note C is the bass. Note C. Then for the treble, it's C, E, G. C, E, G. Do, Do. The next chord that we need is Re. Do, Re. So the moment you identify your ray, you secure your two octave ray, which is a uh, note D, note D. So how do we play the treble? It's D minor, uh, D, F, A, D, F, A. So this is ray, ray. Okay. The next chord that we need is fa, do, re, mi, fa. So the moment you identify your fa, you secure your octave fa for the bass. So F, note F is your fa, and you secure it. So how do we play the treble? The treble can be played as F, A, C. F, A, C. But for the purpose of this lesson, play it C, F A C F A that's for the far okay so somebody will ask F A C is it correct to play F A C for far it's the same it's far the only thing that has changed is this this one is also here so you either play like this or you play like this it's as simple as that that's what we call uh, inversion changing of the positions of the keys the next chord that we need, right, the final chord that we need is so. Do, re, mi, fa, so. So you identify your octave. That's a uh, note G. Note G is your so. Note G is your so. How do we play the treble? The treble is. The treble, for the purpose of this lesson, let's play the treble like this. That's a D, G, B. D, G, B. So the G, the G is the root key. However, if you play it G, B, D, it's also correct. G, B, D, it's also correct. That's the beauty of inversion. So for the purpose of this, let's play it uh, D, G, B. So, so. Okay. How is the song going to move? Uh, as I play, the progression will appear. 
the do will be one one beat then fa one beat then do three beats then fa four beats then do one beat there is a pattern in the song so after playing that you repeat the same pattern again the same chords again so i'll put what i've just played into bracket times two which means play it twice so the second portion of the song is do fa one two three do then fa one two three four then do to finish okay the second uh, portion of the song is do then fast so do you play it fast fast anything you see me put in uh, you see me put fast so do into bracket into bracket that means play it play that a bit faster I don't want to go into details to explain uh, when it comes to playing of keyboard it's a tone semitone or beat one beat two beat quarter a bit and those things uh, i don't want to go in, in, into details uh, because this is beginner's lesson it may confuse you so do then <coughs> fa so do then another fa no do then fa so fa then another fa so do then you come to so do do and end that so that's the second portion of the song okay let's look at something there i say do the do is That's why we play that side faster. Uh -huh. So the other one that I'll put in bracket that's the fa so do is then you end with. Uh, and then you end with the so fa so do then another fa hey, fa so fa then another fa so do then you come to so then you come and play do two, two twice and so twice okay then the next portion of the song the next portion of the song is uh, so a uh, re two beats fa two beats then do one beat so one beat then do three beats one two three then come to so one beat so one beat then come to do two beats then come to so two beats then come to re two beats then you come to fa then you will see fa so do that one to you into bracket you play it a bit faster so fa so do the fa so do is so let's let's go over we'll take it bit by bit the song is a bit longer uh, so we'll take it bit by bit uh, let's play our first part uh -huh.
So that's the first portion of the song. So do, fa, and do three beats, fa, four beats, then do, then you put into brackets, you know. So that's how it is. So um, let's look at the second portion of the song. So as beginners, when you are learning, try and break it into uh, bits, uh, bits and pieces so that you can learn bit by bit. One way you can also do it is try and get uh, the song and uh, as you are playing, you go through the song. That's what I do. I always have, I don't know the songs, so <clears throat> I always have the songs here. Okay, so let's look at the second portion. <laughs> It's as simple as that. It's as simple as that. Okay. Oh, mighty. Let's. We are going to the third portion. Of mighty. simple as that. Let's put it all together and see how it will go. as simple as that as i keep on saying i don't know how i'm not a good singer so pardon my voice with the uh, with the chords but you you can play for your choir you can play for yourself if you know how to sing it so when you are playing you can decide to specialize uh, play with the uh, treble first <laughs> Thank you. 
So you can play with the treble. When you become okay and comfortable, then you can combine the two. But if you are good already and you just you are just interested in the progression, then you can play the two together. Let's go over once more. Let's go over. <clears throat> to this channel please go under the video and press the subscribe button don't forget to let me know where you are watching from bye and see you in the next lesson ciao